I'm gonna miss him. It wasn't you, Eli knows that. Eli thought if we could just hang on, wait it out, Eden's Gate would just go away. But they won't. Fuck, no, they won't. Cancer doesn't fade. It grows. It spreads. You have to cut it out. Yeah. yeah. These fucking Peggy's believe the end of the world yeah. is coming? Yeah. It is for them. Eden's Gate ends today. Fuck those Peggy's! We won't stop until every last one of those motherfuckers yeah. is taken yes. from these trees. Yeah. 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 My children, a seal has been opened. My brother Jacob was a fighter. He fought our parents. He fought the government. He fought me. <laughs> but mostly he fought himself. The demons that he brought home from the war consumed him. He thought he was a weapon without a purpose. That he was a warrior without a legacy. But look around you. You are his legacy. All of you willing to protect our family from the collapse to purge the sinful from our home. And you will, my children. You will purge the sinners from our home. Jacob's death will not be in vain. survive that crash. Maybe all this is purgatory. We have to atone for all the shit we've done before we can leave this place. We have to suffer before God will grant us salvation. It's getting hard to find the gun. What with Jacob and his cock-walking robots dark as the inside of a cow.
These babies are going on the air pronto. You come across any more? I'll add them to the playlist. You know what I like most about you, kid? You got no quit. Hell, I bet you don't even know what that word means, huh? With Jacob and John both put down, that only leaves faith. You know what to do. Dutch out. I wrestled a bear buck naked once. I was gonna do it fully clothed, but I was like, the bear's naked, and I'll be naked. Even played with it from all that.
When I was younger, I spent years searching. I was a rat in a maze, always chasing the same wedge of rancid cheese. Somebody important or something? Father was the first person to help me realize there's Hey, there's my hero. Love. Get over here, honey. It's important. It's a world that welcomes Hi, you sweet open cheeks. arms. So does my mom I'm have to not own this, anymore. or is it mine now because of I'm black liberation? God damn, do you have good timing? Know how to fly a chopper? We need to unwind. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Yes, I'm Herc's mom, and no, I do not want to know what he's been up to. It's called plausible deniability. Appreciate all your help getting my marina back, but honey, I got a problem. Those Peggy shipbirds stole my tulip. She's the nimblest goddamn helicopter this side of Montana, and I'll be goddamned if those fuck trumpets are gonna take her from me. I won that bird in my divorce fair and square. The walking erectile dysfunction who took her painted her that awful shade of Peggy Mayonnaise. So the only way you'll be able to find her is to ID the pilot. Should be easy to spot him. The only other birds around the area are flown by women. We, need we all used one. to fly together on weekends, but that friendship went tits up after those thunder cunts joined Eden's Gate. So I got no problem if you accidentally shoot them in their disloyal faces. We need How about it, honey? You help me? And Tulip and I'll show up wherever and whenever you need us. Man, everybody's been talking about you, and they are right. You got some serious gun food skills, man. You and me. Nights like this one are perfect for running outside naked and humping like teenagers. tend to make me gassy, so crack a window. I see one! Look, over there!
Appreciate it.
Alright, you did good. Well, slap my tits and call me Shirley. You made it just in time for all the fun. And you brought Tulip back in one piece. Now, I always keep my word. So, if you need a pilot who can shoot the dick off a gopher from 50 feet in the air, I'm your gal. You call me, anytime. Except around sunset. Xander likes to do yoga around then, and I like to watch. You ain't lived until you seen that ass and downward facing dog. Anyways, thanks again, hon. I owe ya. You don't exactly look like a I know you've heard stories about me. That I'm a liar. A manipulator. That I poison people's minds. Well, let me tell you a different story. A true story. There once was a young woman who had been ostracized by her community. Lead by friends, abused by her family. She took it to a needle for help. She was all alone. She wanted to die. And then she met the father. <laughs> he gave her hope and confidence. The father showed her how special she was. She was full of love and life. He gave her a new family, one that accepted her just as she was. The young woman no longer wished to die. She had been given purpose. One day, the father brought her here. He asked if she had faith in him. He asked if she would be willing to die for him. The young woman very much wished to live. Who's scared? The father told her this was her test. He would have faith in her if she had faith in him. So she closed her eyes and left. <laughs> father kept his word. The path to Eden is clear to those who have faith. Walk the path. You must have faith. Let go. Let your faith be your guide. Leap. I will give you purpose. I will set you free. Do you feel different? Do you feel alive? This whole place really the first step is always out. the scariest. But we all have faith in you. Follow the pilgrimage. Walk the path. I'll see you soon.
Rook, I need more ammo. You really saved our bacon. They've been throwing themselves at these walls for days. Just won't let up. They already kicked open a hornet's nest. Trucks on the road! Damn it! Rook, I need you up on that wall. There's an Arkweiler somewhere inside. Footy was using it last. Get on it. Well, you're with me. Let's start collecting scrap. You have to pull the doors off some of the cells? Do it! Now hop to! We ain't got much time! Are there problems? No. A couple of the Peggy scaled the wall, but we got them. Door. That doesn't look too bad. You'll be all right. Just keep pressure on it. You know, I was gonna retire last year. I was worried I'd get bored. Are you gonna introduce us, or we're just gonna stand around here all awkward and shit? Language! Oh, fuck off, Virgil. Not today. I have told you, a vulgar mind is a sign of... You're not wearing your button! No, I'm not wearing it. I'll need a casualty report. We're, we're cougars! We're really not. Look, I'm wearing my button. The sheriff is wearing his button. This person... I'm sorry, who is this? This is one of my deputies. I thought you said your deputies were taken. Well, this one wasn't. Been giving Eden's Gate a hell of a time from what I hear. That's so. Well, I hope you plan on pitching in. No room for freeloaders. <laughs> oh, Tracy's all right when she gets to know you. She's right about the work, though. There's plenty to be done around here. Just ask around. Good to have you back, Rook. Okay, then. Howdy, bud. Virgil's tree. Seems like every year some of the flush wound up in my platform. Makes me want to Air take off my skin. Wolf killing, orphan deer. People Deputy, none of my business, but you might want to ask Virgil or the others for an update. They know the places we need to strike. How are you making out? Gonna be honest, never thought I'd see you again. After the crash, I... I just remember fog. Then walking in a field. Then I saw her. You've seen her too, haven't you, Rook? Whatever she says, whatever she promises, it's a lie. Stay away from her, you'll end up just like the Marshal. The bliss. It makes you forget. It makes you feel free. 
You just want to stay there forever. But it isn't real. None of it. If Virgil and Tracy hadn't found me, I'd still be out there, swimming in a sea of bliss. A prisoner in my own head. Those two saved my life. These cougars, they're good people, but they're hanging on by a thread. We gotta help them, Rook. No one else will. One last thing. We had a doctor. Well, a veterinarian, but he's doing his best. Guy went missing a couple hours ago. Don't know why, don't know how. Keep an eye out for him, would you? Hey there, gorgeous. Hey, man. I thought I'd seen it all. The Peggy's really taking it. You're killing anything that moves out here. Who'd have thought the old prison would become a holdout for the resistance? <laughs> Your sheriff seems to know what he's doing, though. Tracy, I've seen around. Mostly keeps to herself. And Virgil, well, he's Virgil. I don't care much for politicians. Do what you can to help him out. You got a sec for I'll me? be in touch. We got one big job around here, and that's to stop Faith. She took everything from me. My job, my marriage, even my son. All because of that bliss. You're one of us now. A cougar. We're a team that helps each other, and I need your help right now, deputy. You know about our water treatment plant? The cult took it and started pumping it full of bliss. You believe that? Right into the drinking water. What kind of monster does that? Well, she's not getting away with it any longer. I tell you straight, we're gonna shut it down fast. What do you say? Yeah, I suppose. God damn it, like I didn't... radio if you hear anything. Job in this place. Just so you know, this whole place is insane. Time to get to work, Rook. I really don't think Charles should wander off like he does. Nice to see a pretty face. I don't know how much they got 24 hour patrols around the statue. It'll be a monster of a job to hit that. Clearing out Thanks the for hitting those I got a challenge for you, if you're up for it. These people are using those trucks and boats to ship it all over Hope County. You'd be doing a lot of good if you destroy you any man? more you find. I say if these folks are making something that kills people, well, they deserve whatever killing comes to their door, if you get my meaning. You gotta help me. Can you believe what they're doing? Bliss is spewing everywhere. It's toxic shit that those Eden's gay bros are shipping everywhere, man. That stuff gets in the river and it's a toxicity tonic. See those big green containers? They're full of bliss and the Peggy's are shipping them somewhere important. We need to find where and destroy them. My life coach says to break problems into bite-sized pieces. So step one. I know about a Peggy laptop that'll help us track down these containers. Once we find them, we blast them! Whoop! This is fantastic. There's new stuff added on the Are you hearing those voices or am I going fucking crazy here? Oh. Hey, Toads forgot to mention. Laptop's gonna connect to the G GPS on their boats. Smart, right? So, like, find the computer, find the boats, then we find their containers. Then you blast them to dust. You! Yeah. I got to get over there. This music gives me life. Oh crap, I need some help. 
GPS lock. Now we can track those boats. You should take to the skies and follow the signal. Addie's got her chopper all fired up. Give her a shout and she'll zip right to you. Get that eagle eye view and find those bliss containers. It's all blathering on about nothing every 15 minutes. My ex, Herc Sr., would never the fuck shut up.
Amendment. Cruising the river, and it sounds like she's called in the chosen. <laughs> 